Hi, I wanted to show you guys what we got for Isaac for Christmas. Um, and just share with you guys a little bit of things that we had. We had a small budget for each child. We have three kids. And um, it was about $100 is what our goal was to spend. And um, I'll show you guys what we have. So we bought him this first. And this is like the Mega Blocks. Um, there it is, right there. Mega Blocks uh, first builders, and it's a Walmart exclusive. This thing, <laughs> it was supposed to be a gift, but he wanted it so bad in the car, and I asked my husband, "Can I please give it to him?" And <laughs> of course, he said, "Yeah." And so he opened this. So I just kept the box, um, just in case anything breaks, I can return it. Um, you know, later down the road, I like to keep the boxes to the toys so that I can return them if something happens to them. Because with kids, you never know. So, Isaac is 18 months old. He turned 18 months on the 5th. So, I'll show you guys more detail what we bought. So, um, first we bought this, and this was like $24.99 at Walmart. And it also has like a little man... Um, that you can like sit on here. He's like a Lego man. And you can see him on here. And it also has stickers that I did not put on, on there. Because Isaac likes to put things in his mouth. And he would just like probably chew the sticker off the Lego. So I didn't put any of the stickers. However, I did save them. So that later down the road if I wanted to look cute or whatever. I can put the stickers on. And it came with the 25 plus 50 Lego Legos, as you can see. Um, Isaac absolutely loves this toy. And um, it's from one to five, uh, to five years old. So I know that he will enjoy it a very long time. So um, I guess that's it for that toy. Um, as far as any details I can tell you guys. Oh, and um, you do turn the little knob in there. And you can lift this up. And in there you can store uh, Legos. And actually a lot of Legos fit in there. Not all of them. Not all 75 of them. But um, a big majority of the Legos, even this little thing, it fits in there. Because all these come up. And then you just switch the dial so that it locks in. And this little guy can just like ride around here on this little thing thingy. So he loves this. Um, I highly recommend this toy. And I got him this the other day at Toys R Us. I've been wanting these um, just so we can, like, sit and play on and, you know, tell him what, what is this, you know, and what letters this. So um, I, I would really prefer, like, the PVC free ones. Um, but I, I just can't find them. I looked for them for a long time when he was smaller and I just wanted a play mat for him. I ended up getting a rug. But um, this... One I got on sale, like on their Toys R Us on Wednesday mornings, like they have the big sales. I was like the first, well, I was the second person in the door. And um, I really just wanted to go there to get this. And this was, regular price is like $24.99 at Toys R Us. And I got it for uh, $12.95 or something. And then my husband picked this for Isaac. Isaac really fell in love with this at... Target. He um, this microphone actually works, so he can hear his voice in it as he sings. It sings all kinds of little music. It does come with batteries already included, and um, you can see as it says it meows and all this good stuff. Um, I would like to play it for you guys, but Isaac might hear it and he might go nuts. Um, but Isaac has really had his eye on this for a while and I love B the B toys because they are very very chemical free and I just I mean I love their toys they make the cutest like toys that you really don't see um, they're real unique I love their toys so um, so check out Target if you want this one are you thinking about this one it's a whole little piano plays all kinds of music sounds um, and it actually records you singing. If you sing, it'll record it, and then you can play it back. 
Um, I don't see the age. Oh, two to six. Usually, as long as they are, um, you know, safe enough that I believe my child can play with them, I don't put a limit on Isaac's learning. He, we will learn as much as we can. So, this here, um, I just bought him two, two, two other ones, so three, and I got these on sale for three dollars. They are just the wooden puzzles. Um, this one I opened because the other two are wrapped. My daughter had already wrapped them. So I just wanted to give you an example of this one. We played with this one and he, you know, he's little. He doesn't fully understand, you know, connect this, this here and stuff like that. But again, it's just us learning and playing together that matters. And it's safe enough for him to play with. They are little wooded, you know, wood type puzzles. And I got these. I got these on sale as well at Toys R Us for three dollars. So I bought three of them for three dollars each. And um, I didn't tell you guys how much the cat costs. It's like twenty. I'm gonna have to guess and say it was like twenty-seven dollars or something like that. I'll have to ask my husband. I'm not quite sure. And I got Isaac these the other day at Toys R Us when I went and got the foam mats. Um, he loves to help daddy with tools and loves the hammer, loves, he actually gets my little, um, measuring tape and walks around with it and tries to measure stuff. So, um, this has a little measuring tape in it. I cannot wait till he opens this one. I'm like super excited. <laughs> I just can't wait. So this is just the little glasses and this one, you just push it here and the little light lights up and it turns... It has this little screw part, which I'm not going to give to him because he is, you know, I have to keep in mind of his age and I'm just not going to give this to him. And um, out of these little products in here, there is a few things that I am not going to allow him to play with just because he's so small still. Um, but the little things that I think that will be okay, of course, we're always supervising him. He doesn't really play alone by himself. Um, there's always somebody with him. But again, let me see what age group this is for. See, this is three and up. So we do have to watch him closely with those. And I um, mean, whatever, whatever um, I think is not safe for him, he will not be playing with. And then he, I had bought him a small doodle pad and um, he like totally loved it. But one day he brought it to me and he was crying because he wanted me to cut the string off. And I mean, he wanted to take the pin off, so I thought he wanted me to cut the string off, so I cut the string on both ends. And he was crying, a poor thing. So, um, even though I cut the string off, I still got to return it. And I just went ahead and got him a bigger one. And this one was also on sale that day at Toys R Us, uh, along with these. These were um, buy one, get one, half off. And I want to say this one was like $16.99. And then this one was half off, which made it like 6 bucks because I think it was like $12.00. And then this was on sale for $15, like $14.95. And the regular price on these are like $19.99. So um, we got that one. And um, that's pretty much like all we got him. My daughter, she, she wrapped these gifts. I, I hate wrapping presents. Isaac's going to rip through this. So um, nothing fancy. My This is a ball popper. And it's just a little simple, like it was 8 bucks uh fisher price i think or a little tight something i don't know it's just the, you know that regular ball popper you push it and it like pops the balls pops the balls nothing fancy uh, he actually loves it at church they have one and um he doesn't want to let it go and in here um my son wrapped this one already as well this is a um melissa and doug um Play-Doh set I got really cheap at Ross. Um, I want to say it was, I don't even remember, like $6.99 was the price. And um, it's super cute. It's Play-Doh with like a little roller, rolling pin. You can like roll this the um, Play-Doh and it's, it's for us to play together. Um, he will not be playing with those toys unsupervised. So, because I... You know, he might eat the Play-Doh. So, um, and I know you can make your own Play-Doh, which would be okay if he eats it, but no. So, 
that is all he got for Christmas from us, Grandma and Grandpa. And um, Auntie and her other Auntie got him a few things. But this is all we got. So I uh, hope you guys enjoy. And I hope there was enough information for you guys. If you are interested um, in anything else, you can just comment below. And um, I can tell you guys anything that's more specific. But thanks for watching. Thanks, guys.